Now, Seven, there is some serious swagger right now in Coral Gables. That's right. The University of Miami Hurricanes are getting their fans fired up as they prepare for the biggest game of the season so far. They invented swagger, and there's <laughs> definitely some canes over there in the Gables. Jim Barry is with them. And, Jim, have you found my turnover chain yet? Elliot, I have not found your turnover chain, but I do have something you can wear to the game on Saturday. They were handing all these out to the students. So, Elliot, okay. this is just for you, my man. You can wear this Saturday night at Hard Rock Stadium when the Canes take on Notre Dame. And, of course, the excitement is definitely here. You hear them behind me yelling, beat Notre Dame, because that's what the Canes want to see. The rivalry is here, and this game is absolutely enormous, and everybody here on campus knows it. About an hour or so ago, we heard from UM football coach Mark Richt. He talked to the huge pep rally here gathered at the Rock, and he thanked the fans and the students for their support. He said without the 12th man, Rock and Hard Rock Stadium, the Canes probably wouldn't be where they are right now. Of course, the Canes undefeated, ranked seventh in the nation. If they can knock off third-ranked Notre Dame, hey, they could be right in the thick of the national championship discussion. That is the goal. Who would have expected that this soon, just two years after Mark Richt arrived, the Canes could be knocking on the doorstep of something really special. What about this school spirit? It's unbelievable. These these guys are awesome. Uh, come out in this evening, and of course it is a beautiful evening to be out here. But uh, great turnout. Of course the bands here, all the other programs are here, the other uh, basketball programs are here, and uh, it's a great night. So how are you feeling about this one? About this game? Yeah, I'm excited. It's a great opportunity for us. Mark Rick very understated, but he knows what is at stake. Of course, this is his alma mater. This is why he came back to the U. And certainly we're all eager to see exactly how his team performs on Saturday night. Live at the University of Miami, I'm Jim Barry, CBS4 Sports. Jim, way back in 1988, it was Catholics versus convicts. Saturday, it'll be rosaries versus chains. Do you think these two teams will live up to all this hype? <laughs> You know, that is a very good question. In a lot of ways, there are mirror images. This is two, our two programs who really have fought their way back. Notre Dame has been very impressive this year, I must say that, been winning by an average of about 20 points per game. The Canes, of course, have won some squeakers, but they've shown a lot of character. And that's why I think this matchup is so interesting. So, yes, Elliot, to your point, I do think that we could be in for another classic UM Notre Dame game on Saturday night. I've got my ticket. It's going to be an exciting time at the uh, Hard Rock Stadium on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Jim Barry live for us at the University of Miami. Rose